Hello friends and welcome back on my channel. Uh, my name is Mr. Alex and today I will explain you how to solve the key mapping situation after the season 6 update in Call of Duty Mobile. We have struggled a little bit to find a solution for this issue. For example, you are not able to prone or you are not able to do the slides in this game. After a little bit of research and um, some help from uh, my uh, supporters, I have found a solution. It's very, very easy. All you have to do is to open your game loop, go to the key mapping settings here on the top of the screen, open it. And here, in my case, I am using control instead of Z and C over here for the slides, okay? So basically, the C button is not working by default if you would want to do some slides in the game. So for this, all you have to do is to delete this C key and create another one and rename it the same and um, put it in the same place over here and move it just a little bit i think call of duty mobile uh, moved the original buttons uh, from the game and we are not able to match our key mapping with the in-game buttons for myself i'm using control instead of z so you have to do the same if you're uh, using the z button instead of uh, control all you have to do is to move this a little bit this key needs to be moved a little bit on the screen until you will match with the basically <laughs> invisible uh, in-game button uh, in my case i'm using control instead of z so this is all you have to do is very very simple um, after this all you have to do is to save the game to save the key mapping and that's it. All you have to do now is to play. And also, another situation that you have encountered this uh, in this new update is the drop frame. Well, I'm using a GPU, an RTX 3090 and an i9 and I'm still facing this situation. This is because of the Call of Duty Mobile update or because uh, the game loop emulator is not able to render the graphics very good but if you still uh, want my settings just go to settings open the emulator on the basic tab you have these settings i have these settings on engine i'm using on uh, i'm using the direct x plus and i have checked all of these four boxes of the anti-aliasing is off everything else is on automatic and the screen dpi is on 240 the model is by default and the game is very important here as well uh, use the 1080p if it's working for you uh, on hd and also on the graphics quality um, choose the smooth quality and it's very good save it and also in game use the same settings that i have used before um, this video in my other video you'll see the same settings for 60 fps in this game use the frame rate to 60 and the graphic quality to low i assure you that these settings are very good for your gameplay and you will um, have a very smooth uh, game uh, with your uh, friends and against your enemies um, if you like this channel if you enjoy the settings and if everything works fine for you don't forget to like and subscribe the channel and share it and invite your friends to copy these settings because they are working and they are legit in my case are working very good and i have no issues happy gaming everyone gg